De La Wright, my envy this. Welcome. Blow Blow is alleged to have narrowly, you know, escaped a snake bite. And, you know, as she was running kitty kata kata kitty from pillar to post, she um, really injured herself like she sprained her ankle from what we are hearing. I think her ankle or leg or somewhere. They said that um, um, that was what happened to her. Now, they said this happened right there in um, the Olori's um, mansion where she is. Now, when you look at how sophisticated that place is, because if you have been following this trend with the Oni of Ife, you get to understand that Oni of Ife is somebody who has got very great taste, okay? Now, um, from where the, when the last Oni of Ife was in the palace, before um, Ogun, see, Ade, Ye, Ye, um, the king, with due respect, took over, you, you can see the trend transformation that happened in the palace of the Oni of Ife. A lot of us uh, um, do think that, you know, the palace of the Oni of Ife has always been that beautiful edifice, edifice that you are seeing there. No, it has not been like that. It's when Oni of Ife, you know, um, Oba Adeyi took over that he made that place what it is today, Okay. And so, because um, he got married to these women and um, by right, traditionally, and all of that, that they, they are associated with him. Even if he had said his wife were not going to stay with him, of course, you do know that with the kind of test board that Oni of Ife has, Oni will not take them and put them in a place that is not befitting. And besides, these women are all making a lot of money for themselves. They all have pedigree and all of that. And so, um, um, even if you don't provide for them, they have their own. And they said, this Olori mansion, or Olori quarters, where they took, asked the Oloris to move to. They said the place is so beautiful, so sophisticated. And as a matter of fact, it wasn't an old building that was renovated. It is a brand new building. How they crawled into Blue Blue's house is what nobody understands. They said that inside her bedroom, as uh, she was sleeping when she woke up, she said there was a, a, a big snake staring her in the face. She jumped. And when she jumped, that was when she sprained her ankle. And they said that she narrowly escaped it. And when she screamed, people came, that snake disappeared, that they ransacked. The entire room went right, went left and all of that. And Blah Blah was screaming that the snake was just there. The snake was just there. How the snake could have disappeared, like where the snake disappeared is what nobody knows. And a lot of people are beginning to attribute this to nemesis. Some people are saying uh, she's under some kind of attack and all of that. And they said that the family is already very scared because they want her to be very, very careful. But where is the decoco of the G's? They say that Kavye C after learning of the event, people were, were expecting Kabiesi to have, you know, done something like, you know, um, try to kind of help all, you know, um, um, you know, they said he showed zero concern, like he didn't even bother whether they said snake wanted to buy the woman or the woman wanted to buy snake. No, nothing, nothing, nothing. He did not bother. And they said this really devastated the woman who cried so much. Now, you do know that from time, um, 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 uh, we have had a lot of things from um, the artifact, from this thing that um, has been planted in the palace, and a whole lot of stuff have been done. Now, it is important for people to understand that um, um, a person no rob Vitali, Vitali no they rob him. I do also understand that good or bad things can happen to both good or bad people, or, or, or uh, but of course we do know that. This one may be some kind of nemesis. So right now, they said they are telling Blow Blow that that is warning number one. That that snake that appeared, they actually came to warn her, to let her know that her cop done the full small small. Now, I go back to what Mommy Abe used to say. She says every time that, look, if one person no pay for this matter, they will not leave that girl alone. Right now, with what Reverend Esther Ajay is saying, <laughs> they need to be very, very careful Careful because uh, when it will begin to happen, it will be as if, you know, um, um, it, they will not understand that it is because of the seed that they have sown. 
Because Naomi is a daughter of Zion. There is never a time where God will allow his own to be put to shame. This is one of those, you know, um, situations where God is going to show himself really strong. And they should be very careful. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Dela Ram. I bring you fresh and spicy juice from the south. And still on the royals. How are you guys doing? I appreciate you guys so much. I love you. I thank you. A show adukbeo, my people. If you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And do not forget to turn on the notification bell. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. As it is reaching also, allegedly, as it is reported, rumored, and no be me talk humbly. Yes, so if this information is true, they said blow blow actually, actually escaped um, a snake bite. That she was there in her room. This thing just appeared from nowhere. She was seeing it as if it was a dream. Then she found out that it wasn't even a dream, that it was real that the thing appeared in her room and was staring her in the face as if it was something that was staring her. So right now, the family is running kitty kata, kitty kata, because they said that that is how Osuranga, um, uh, Yami Osuranga attacks, okay? That she attacks like a snake. Now they are running kitty kata, kitty kata to go and appease Osuranga, and the priest who is in charge of Osuranga is saying it, it's not going to happen, that they are not going to use him they should hire another priest and they are not going to do it in his shrine now they said the, the, the snake just came appeared and was looking that woman in the face as if with so much anger so much animosity as if he wanted to do and undo like right there and right now that the woman jumped the woman was screaming shouting people came that a lot of people actually came home to her rescue because of the way she screamed. When they came, they said there was no way that um, a, a snake would have escaped, but they said the snake escaped. Nobody could tell where the snake went to. Nobody could tell, tell what the mission of that snake in that house was, but everybody, those who know, the Yoruba people, the tradition, they say, Yami Osuranga, is at work. That was a warning. So it's not a small something. No. Hey, hey, hey. It's not a small something at all. They said, person will say mama no go sleep. He can't say mama no go sleep. He said he no go feel sleep at all, at all. They, they have, you know, they said, Macbeth said something that you have murdered sleep and you shall sleep no more. Now, if this information is true, knowing that these are all are less speculated and rumored information, if this information is true, this is what is going on. It is beginning to look like Yami Osuranga has decided to take the laws into her own hand. I'm going to bring you more updates. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you.